Ever wonder how some people become millionaires before they hit 40? You see them driving fancy cars, living in big houses. It's easy to think they got lucky. But here's the truth. Luck has very little to do with it. Wealth, especially at a young age, is built on a foundation of smart choices, hard work, and a whole lot of hustle. The good news is you can do it too. You don't need a trust fund or a winning lottery ticket. What you need is a plan. A plan to take control of your money, invest it wisely, and watch it grow. This isn't about getting rich quick. This is about building a life of financial security, freedom, and opportunity. A life where you're in the driver's seat, calling the shots. The journey to wealth starts with a simple question. Why wait? Why wait until you're 65 to enjoy the fruits of your labor? Time is your greatest asset. The sooner you start, the more time your money has to compound and grow. So let's stop wondering how others do it and start talking about how can achieve financial freedom before 40. Are you ready to get started? Let's get one thing straight. Being rich and being wealthy are not the same thing. Sure, they both involve having money, but the difference lies in what that money represents and how you got there. Being rich is often about appearances. It's about having expensive things, flashing cash, and living a life of luxury, even if it's all built on debt. It's a temporary state, easily lost with one wrong move. Wealth, on the other hand, is about security, freedom, and lasting legacy. It's about having your money work for you, not the other way around. It's about building a solid financial foundation that can weather any storm. Wealth is about leaving a legacy for your family, not just a pile of bills. You see, true wealth is built on a foundation of financial literacy, smart investments, and living below your means. It's about making your money work harder than you do. It's about having the freedom to pursue your passions, give back to your community, and live life on your own terms. So which one do you want? Fleeting riches or lasting wealth? The choice is yours. Before we dive into the practical steps of building wealth, we need to talk about the most important tool you have. Your mindset. You see, becoming wealthy isn't just about what you do with your money. It's about how you about money. If you approach wealth building with a scarcity mindset, always fearing loss and clinging to every penny, you'll likely sabotage your own success. You'll be too afraid to invest, too hesitant to take calculated risks, and too focused on saving your way to wealth. Spoiler alert, it's incredibly difficult. Instead, cultivate an abundance mindset. Believe that there are endless opportunities to create wealth. Embrace challenges as opportunities for growth. See money as a tool to build the life you want, not as something to be feared or worshipped. This shift in mindset will empower you to make bold decisions, take calculated risks, and attract abundance into your life. Remember, your thoughts become your reality. So start thinking like the wealthy person you aspire to be. Now, let's talk about financial independence. This is the ultimate goal, the pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Financial independence means having enough wealth to support your desired lifestyle without relying on a job or anyone else for money. Imagine waking up every morning and doing exactly what you want. Want to start a business, travel the world, spend more time with family? Financial independence gives you the freedom to do all of that and more. It's about breaking free from the shackles of a 9-to-5 job and living life on your own terms. It's about having the financial security to pursue your passions, give back to your community, and spend your time doing what truly matters to you. Financial independence is not a pipe dream. It's a very real possibility for anyone willing to put in the work, make smart decisions, and stay disciplined. It's the ultimate reward for taking control of your finances and building a life of abundance. Building your wealth fortress, brick by brick. Building wealth is like constructing a fortress. It's a step-by-step -step process that requires patience, discipline, and a solid plan. There's no magic formula, but there are proven strategies that can help you get there faster. The first step is to start early. Time is your greatest ally when it comes to building wealth. The sooner you start saving and investing, the more time your money has to compound and grow exponentially. Even small amounts invested consistently over time can add up to significant wealth. Next, you need to develop a budget and stick to it. This doesn't mean depriving yourself of everything you enjoy. It's about being mindful of your spending, cutting out unnecessary expenses, and allocating your money towards your financial goals. Finally, you need to invest your money wisely. This means understanding different investment vehicles, diversifying your portfolio, and taking calculated risks to maximize your returns. Investing is not gambling. It's about putting your money to work for you and letting it grow over the long term. Remember, building wealth is a marathon, not a sprint. It requires patience, discipline, and a commitment to making smart financial decisions day in and day out. 
The power of compound interest, your money's best friend. Let's talk about compound interest, often called the eighth wonder of the world. It's a powerful force that can turn small amounts of money into a substantial fortune over time. Simply put, compound interest is the interest you earn on your initial investment plus the interest earned on your accumulated interest. Imagine a snowball rolling down a hill. As it rolls, it picks up more snow, becoming bigger and bigger. That's compound interest in action. Your money is the snowball, and the interest it earns is the snow. The longer the snowball rolls, or the longer your money stays invested, the bigger it gets. Here's an example. Let's say you invest $1,000 today at a 7% annual return. After one year, you'll have $1,070. But here's where the magic happens. In year two, you're earning interest on $1,070, not just your initial $1,000, this snowball effect continues year after year, leading to exponential growth. The key takeaway? Start investing early, and let compound interest work its magic. The earlier you start, the more time your money has to grow, and the more significant your returns will be. Diversify your income streams. Don't put all your eggs in one basket. Relying solely on your 9-to-5 job is like putting all your eggs in one basket. If something happens to that job, your entire income stream is at risk. That's why it's crucial to diversify your income and create multiple streams of revenue. Think of it like having multiple rivers flowing into a lake. If one river dries up, the lake is still fed by other sources. Similarly, having multiple income streams provides financial security and peace of mind. There are countless ways to diversify your income. You could start a side hustle, invest in rental properties, create and sell online courses, or explore the world of online business and e-commerce. The key is to find something you're passionate about and leverage your skills and interests to create additional income streams. Remember, diversifying your income isn't about spreading yourself too thin. It's about creating multiple streams of revenue that complement each other and provide you with financial stability and freedom. Mastering the market, investing for long-term growth. Investing in the stock market can seem intimidating, especially for beginners, but it's one of the most effective ways to grow your wealth over the long-term. The key is to approach it with a long-term mindset a solid understanding of the fundamentals, and a healthy dose of risk management. Start by educating yourself about different investment vehicles such as stocks, bonds, mutual funds, and exchange-traded funds, or ETFs. Each has its own risk and reward profile, and understanding how they work is crucial for making informed investment decisions. Don't fall for get-rich-quick schemes or try to time the market. Instead, focus on building a diversified portfolio of quality investments that align with your risk tolerance and financial goals. Consider investing in low-cost index funds that track the performance of a specific market index, providing broad market exposure and diversification. Remember, investing is a marathon, not a sprint. It's about making consistent contributions over time, riding out market fluctuations and letting compound interest work its magic. With patience, discipline, and a sound investment strategy, you can achieve significant long-term growth and secure your financial future. Avoiding financial pitfalls. Don't fall into the traps. The road to wealth is paved with good intentions but also littered with potential pitfalls. Knowing what to avoid is just as important as knowing what to do. Common financial mistakes to avoid. 1. Racking up debt. High interest debt is a wealth killer. It eats away at your income and prevents you from building a solid financial foundation. Pay off your debts quickly and avoid new debt. 2. Living beyond your means. Trying to keep up with the Joneses is a recipe for financial disaster. Live below your means, save consistently, and invest the difference. True wealth is about financial security, not material possessions. Burying your head in the sand won't make your financial problems disappear. Take control of your finances, create a budget, track your spending, and make informed decisions about your money. 4. Failing to plan for the future. The sooner you start saving and investing for retirement, the more time your money has to grow and the more comfortable your golden years will be. Remember, financial mistakes are part of the learning process. Learn from them, adjust your course, and stay committed to your financial goals. You've got this taking control of your financial future. Building wealth and achieving financial independence is a journey, not a destination. It takes time, effort, and a willingness to learn and adapt. But most importantly, it takes a belief in yourself and your ability to achieve your financial goals. You don't need a fancy degree or a trust fund to become wealthy. You need a plan, a willingness to work hard, and a commitment to making smart financial decisions. Remember, the only person stopping you from achieving financial freedom is yourself. Start small, take action, 
and celebrate your progress along the way. Every step you take, no matter how small, is a step in the right direction. And as you gain momentum, you'll find that the journey itself becomes incredibly rewarding. Believe in yourself, trust the process, and never give up on your dreams. You've got this. Start today, not tomorrow. Your journey to wealth begins now. The best time to plant a tree was 20 years ago. The second best time is today. The same goes for building wealth. Don't wait for the perfect time to start because that time never comes. Start today, even if it's just with a small amount of money. Take action on what you've learned. Create a budget, open a savings account, start investing, and explore new income streams. The more you do, the more confident you'll become, and the closer you'll be to achieving your financial goals. Remember, the journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Take that step today and never stop moving towards the life of financial freedom and abundance you deserve. The future is yours to create, yours to 